well, can I do this today without hitting very many parked cars? We'll see. We'll see what happens. But it ain't the stuff over here that's gonna get you. It's it's over here. But well, whatever. It's, ah, see? Here's a fool. I pity the fool. Yep, and here comes one on my right side. They don't realize that this tractor is going to swing out all the way to the curb and smash their beautiful mid-sized SUV. They probably just made their last payment. Haha. <laughs> yeah, you, bud. <laughs> Whatever you do, don't hit the Porsche. Oh, that, that's not here at the moment. Usually there is right where this gray car is. And then there's always some on this side. Because why not put a few parking spots, you know, right along here. Plenty of room. What was that? Oh, <laughs> they're dumping glass into the dumpster back there. I heard glass breaking. I'm like, what did I hit? Okay. This guy on a forklift back there. There's a man lift here. Stuff to watch on both sides and up. Yeah. And this is my opportunity to open the doors. So I'm backing up to that dock. And Burger King's over there, but I'm not not going there. And when you open these doors, yeah, be careful where you stand in case stuff falls out. It happens to Pete. Happened to one of our guys. Stuff. Rax fell out and landed on him. Everybody went home. Usually there's cars parked all along there to screw me. So this should be easy. Visual cues are different without all the parked cars too, because I usually, you know, know where to turn, start turning at the Lexus or whatever. You get the idea. And of course, I used to think that you want your trailer tandem slid, you know, all the way forward so you can you know turn sharper but all that tail swing man that's what gets you that's I hit the bumper of a car 
once just with the tail swing. The poor receptionist at the business just a couple miles from here was with a different trucking company. I actually paid her myself for it because my company for some reason wouldn't uh, do anything for her. They were like, eh, whatever. Okay, I'm hmm, on the wrong side of the line. Paul, if you could paint a nice yellow line. Just saying. Because they're moving out of this building in a couple months, so they ain't gonna wanna do nothing for the upkeep of this place. I guess that's good enough. You get out here and look and you say, oh, okay, it's pretty straight. But then you walk around to the other side. And it'll be like at a 45 degree angle. Well, huh. Eh. That eh, might not work, but we'll go inside and see. See what it looks like. Oh, hey. Uh. Yeah. Questionable. That's <laughs> pretty full load, ain't it? Yes. They decide to send all of it. <laughs> I assume there's nothing on this one on the left. Probably not. 